Uh, Joseph, it's 55 degrees here in Portland. Nice night, especially to go out there. Yeah, yeah. it's perfect. Get out there and enjoy it. Yes. Uh, after this, you know, right. go have some dinner outside, go for a hike, a walk. Uh, it's wonderful weather for that. We had some rain early this morning, but by the afternoon, not bad. Let's take a look at what we have going out there right now. We have a couple nice shots actually set up. Portland at 55 degrees, a few clouds rolling on through, just dancing on by. Not bad there. Scamania at 55, Astoria 51. And just a nice dry time there. Meadows at 34 degrees, a little bit cooler. Not much snow, at least for Meadows today, but still a great day to get up there and maybe get up on the mountain. It's 51 in Astoria and 52 in Newport. If you're along the coast, a few clouds there, but pretty mild. All the way stretching through the central section of Oregon, all the way to the east, 47 in Pendleton. A pretty warm day for our Saturday. As we head into the evening, we'll be cooling down to the 50s. I'm going to keep rain pretty much out of here through the next couple of hours, maybe a sprinkle later on this evening, but I think we should stay mostly dry as we go through the remainder of today. Notice that the rain showers that were out there for this afternoon and evening have all pretty much dissipated and dried on up. We just have a few clouds that are moving from the coast all the way to the east. That will eventually bring in some light rain showers as we get into tomorrow. So this is what we're going to be watching. We have this big system. It's going to track off to the northeast. That will bring in the rain come tomorrow morning and then another event Monday night and we're looking at some pretty active weather as we go through the work week, maybe picking up up to uh, two inches to three inches of rain showers. So quiet finish as we go into this evening. Again, if you're going to maybe go for a bike ride, a hike, a walk, it's going to be just nice for that. Uh, eventually, as we get into tomorrow morning, though, that's when things are going to start to change. That's going to bring the rain showers in. You'll probably want to be prepared for that, especially if you have any plans tomorrow morning. So this is how we break down our Sunday. Temperatures cooling down tonight into about the upper 40s. Keep the rain in there. We'll be warming up to about 53 degrees by the time we get into the afternoon and evening, cooling down to the 40s. But notice that we do have a pretty much a scattered threat for some rain showers as we go through most of the day tomorrow. So starting off pretty dry to the east uh, this evening. We'll notice as we go through the overnight, kind of dries on up, a few clouds passing on by. It's going to be early tomorrow morning, probably close to 3.30 in the morning for the coast for those rain showers. Eventually moving to the interior section through the valley as we get to about 4.30 tomorrow morning. Some light to moderate rain showers at time. We could pick up about a half an inch tomorrow, maybe even a little bit more than that. And that could be even uh, some snowfall for the mountains. So as you're going up to the mountain tomorrow, if you're doing some snow uh, boarding or skiing or just hitting the slopes up there, expect maybe a couple inches of some fresh powder for you folks. That's going to be really nice. It does kind of taper down and kind of lose some of that energy by the time we get into the evening. That will kind of calm us down, setting up for a pretty nice Monday morning until our next wave rolls on in as we get into our pretty much our commute home Monday evening. So we will stay pretty dry as we go through the next couple of hours, but here's our coastal forecast come tomorrow. The rain will return. Temperatures warming up to about the 50s, 51 degrees in Astoria, and a daytime high at Seaside at 51. We'll keep the lower 50s through the I-5 corridor. Just some rain showers through the morning, a southwest breeze right around 10 to 20 miles per hour. A few clouds off to the east. You'll have the better chance to see some sunshine tomorrow morning, and then if we get into the gorge, we'll have some breezy and cloudy conditions and maybe some snowfall uh, tomorrow with that snow level right around 4,000 feet. Uh, the end of the meteorological winter is on Monday. That means we start the meteorological spring calendar, which will be really nice. And temperature is going to look pretty much uh, close to that in the 50s and but with a little bit of rain showers. I'm excited for that. And daylight oh, saving yeah, time is coming up as well. Yep, so right. more light at nighttime. Yep. All right. Thank